G'day and welcome back to our Belgian waffle campaign in Hearts of Iron 4. Is it time to do the invasion of Ibiza? The Belarus down here. He's got crazy defense from being dug in there for how many years it's been. But we'll pick him out of there eventually. As long as he doesn't try and reinforce it. And as long as our submarines don't get knocked out and all of these guys killed. There's a few ifs. They are. No, they're nationalist fleet. Oh, that's fine then. Seeing they are the Republican fleet. Does he not have one? He has a fleet. It's keeping him away. He has a stronger fleet. Okay. Well, that'll be fine then. The Americans moving around. One of them is ours. Found a couple of panzers down in Africa during the break on the islands here. I don't know how long they've been there or how they got there. One there, one there. Probably... No, no idea. Might have been Spanish before. Makes sense, that island. And it would have been part of the um, expedition thing that we sent out. That's why it wasn't part of our guys. I only noticed it because it was on here. Usually I'd keep an eye on this. Holy crap, there are some more. Alright, one, two, three, four, five. Force public do thing. He's probably the one that's uh, down there. Yep. I guess we'll take him though. If all of them can come back home somewhere without trying to walk through Russia. It would have to be this guy. He's on the port province too. Alright, how about walk up here to start with. We'll sort him out once he gets here. That's that province, I think. Okay. Research would be for the next one, the S port. And keep pushing our air doctrine. Because we really need to destroy those Russian bombers. We only have two civilian factories left really sucks. All right, can we get any more from drop and trade? Possibly. I doubt we'll be allowed to. We are. Yeah, we get a tiny surplus. Okay. Back down here. We're now losing. Hmm. Well, if you're just going to lose, then forget about it. How do we abandon? Can't tell them to stop. Hold the divisions. Holding takes them back where they came from. Okay. So this guy wandering through the Suez Canal. There he comes. Hmm. I thought we lost the bloody fleet then. It wasn't down here. Alright, we'll put them all back together. And we'll just send the full-size invasion directly to the mainland. You know, drop your guys off. There we go. Alright, these are all one. There's something missing from there. It wasn't 24 guys that came back. Hmm. Okay, we'll accept that this time. But we are going to cancel their orders. We're going to reset this naval invasion. We're going to go from where you are and straight past them and somewhere that's probably the most likely to be empty. We're not going to go straight to this this time. We're going to have enough guys landing to be able to do some real damage. He really wants a non-aggression pact. And running short on aluminium. At least it's less of a shortage this time. It only costs us one factory. Okay, landing craft. 100 days. Hit 
1945. Russians are still trying to attack us too. Alright, I've got some close air support. Get going for the next one. I'm going to start pumping them out. They're going to help us with our invasion of uh, probably Russia. We will become large, feasting on the Soviet Union, and then we can turn back here. Destroy Paris. What the hell are you doing, France? Is this US? That's France, yeah. It's asking for more provinces. Which means France must be doing more of the work in their war somewhere. Which one's uh, F6? Is F6? Yeah, it's the occupation one. I don't seem to mind it too much down there. So these ones, pretty sure I already bumped up. Yeah, all of the Germans bumped up the harshest so that we can get the factory output. It makes the occupations cost more, but Fine. Right, the coups happening early next year too, aren't they? In Brazil. 18th of February, same for Colombia. Keep an eye out for that. Our manpower has finally expired and we've run out of political power. We are going to cancel maybe Portugal. Alright, cancel boost popularity there for now. Minus 0 0.09 should get us through to February. Then we'll get a big gain because we won't be doing the things anymore. How are the other ones we're supporting going? Ecuador, Bolivia, Colombia. No. We are still boosting in Colombia. That was a mistake. Alright, we can cancel boosting there. Actually, we might as well leave them going. Um, Ecuador. I know I should know where it is. Ecuador, right there. Uh, he's not doing very well. It's probably from the um, democracy drift. This is probably where it evens out because the Americans think. And there goes last of the manpower. We've got a month before we can do this. Alright, let's forget about Ecuador then. Cancel boosting popularity there for now. We'll come back over and try and remember to do the bit more. Or just start their coup. I don't know. Depends how Brazil goes. Alright, finished our jets. We don't want to go ahead for this one. Doubles the operational range. Air attacks the same. Speeds the same. Ah, speeds faster for me. Everything's the same. It's just longer range. Takes not that much more. All right, it's not worth it. We would like nothing else from there. Nothing else from here. Air Doctrine we're doing, Air, Naval Doctrine, no, this we're doing, Land Doctrine, we were doing Infiltration, we never started, no, we're doing these, and we're up to Extra Breakthrough in 90 days, absolutely. Advanced Landcraft will be after the coup starts, so we can take a look at that. Uh, Brazil, what is your story at the moment? Oof, that's really bad. This was a tiny sliver when we started the coup, so that's the power of what the Americans are doing. Uh, we would like to invite them. They are slightly off. 
have war they may be drawn into, and they have neutral foreign policy. Wouldn't even accept non-aggression. Well, that's why you're going to go cuckoo. Alright, the US at the moment has no national focus. I think he's finished them all. And Mexico. Very democratic. Canada. Not doing much. As usual. Just chilling. He's still doing stuff. Sanction Japan. Which be located it's political, it's probably on the right side. True gas masks. National unity goes up 10. That's cool. Home defense gives you coastal forts. I've actually got coastal forts in London. It's going to be nasty to attack them. War with Germany gains a puppet focus war goal against German Reich. Alright. Fortnite to go. Liberia. It's still Liberia. Should have sent some guys over there. We had them nearby. We still do. But we can't attack from there. Because it's a neutral country. Alright, forget that. Yeah, when we sent the expeditionary force here, they must have actually spread out on the islands and everything. Never noticed them. They've been sitting there the whole game. Better. Get used to checking this a bit more often. One, two, three. You are all up here. Attach you to this. And bring all these guys down. Alright, there goes the coup. Rexus Belgium succeeded in doing it down there. New Grand Colombia declared war on Colombia. And in Brazil, Integralist Brazil. So, hopefully they're large coups and they will succeed. It is not. <laughs> what the hell was even the point of doing that? After the amount of time that we wasted doing them. Alright. And look at him, he's... Yeah, God. Alright, the other one was Colombia. New Grand. They look tiny as well. He's got five to six guys. What the hell, man? Alright, diplomacy. Invite you to the faction. You're in civil war, so you won't do it. Well, the Spanish were in civil war, and they still did it. Alright, after all that, it's a complete waste. Non aggression pact request from Yugoslavia. No. Well, we get to start building our political power back up again. So you're going to keep going in. Well, it's nationalist Chile now, so that worked. Yep, yeah, he's fascist. Cancel that. Uh, what was the other one? Bolivia. Go back to boosting in Peru. And in Ecuador. Venezuela's fascist. Colombia, we should have just kept it going. Uh, Ecuador, we're doing. Right, where's the other one? Panama. Not Venezuela. Brazil won't be worth the expense, but we'll keep it going. And Paraguay is communist, we never touched them. Uh, Honduras and Nicaragua are no. Panama and Costa Rica is a yes. Alright, still make it a profit. That'll do. Alright, so much for them. If you just join our faction, we'd 
not actually release it to you, but we make you think we might want to release it to you after we come over there and sort it out, like we're about to do for Spain. 20 days to landing craft. It's complete lack of manpower. I don't like. We have supply. Hmm. Must be just from building the planes. Infantry equipment's just gone mad. Alright, 80,000 up, but it's all out of date. Out of light tanks, out of support equipment. Haven't made them for a long time. Alright, got the surplus there. Um, these are actually being repaired now. So we only have four. Trying to repair them. And then our reactors. Yeah, we're going to finish our nuclear weapon half a year. The research to start them anyway. We've got none of the reactors ready for when we do. Four days. Can't start their planning yet because we can't put them on the actual thing. Right, waiting for a few more tanks to arrive anyway. So that's fine. There we go. Advanced landing craft. Uh, details. Hidden down the bottom there like that. Um, infantry. Weaponry. Now, these guys attached to that, it'll take 353 transports, and we still have 300 left over. Good. That's why you keep making them. And we should be ready to go. Got the Air Force in there, and the Navy in there. for a landing. Alright. I have to prepare for more than a year. Wow. Alright. That's, yeah. <laughs> I guess. Makes sense. I don't know that the UK prepared for that long. It's like France is still just asking people for more. They've got to be doing something. Who are they still at war with? Uh, at war with... Japan, Slovakia, Italy. Well, Slovakia's gone. Italy's gone. They're at war with China. So the United States is doing everything over there. There is a big French blob though, so they must be losing a lot of men there and that's giving them the right to ask for more land in Europe. Uh, well, Germany's gone. Yeah, and Siam. So France are doing stuff there and there. And the fact that their people are dying and they've probably got planes bombing people over here means that they're getting extra war score or participation that they can use. Republican Spain. This is the Spanish War. I keep forgetting this Spanish Civil War. Still going in 1945, along with Colombian Civil War that's going to end. Brazilian Civil War won't last long. So let's go take a look at that flag. Can't quite see what it is. Looks cool. Assault breakthrough. And planning speed. Well, hopefully max planning goes up 10% so we can plan 110% uh, hopefully that will reduce the planning time for naval as well so 130 days in and the 
Soviet, Soviet Union still only has 30 subs there. I think they would have lifted their game by now. Shoot him. Shoot him back in the boat. Brazil took Integralist Brazil. That didn't take him long. Had 10 times the army. These guys might be able to last longer because they're in mountains. There's only one mountain province though. Jungle and... Yeah, mountain. Mountain. Plains. Forest. Yeah, don't like their chances. Operational destruction. Let's just start fitting into these. Air support, mission efficiency, or just fighter agility. That's more important. Fighter agility and heavy fighter agility. What's it for? Details. Right, he's got 40 odd. This guy has. Four. Again, 10 to 1 odds, and they were pretty equal in the popularity. It's Republic of Peru. Stop being that. Just need this to boost up to like 50 something percent. I'll do what these dudes did. And just take over peacefully. It's Brazil we needed most. Brazil have by far the largest army down here. Hmm. How many more guys are we getting? Where's their recruitable goes up one and a half thousand per month? Where's the thing that shows us? How many men short we are? Uh, this one, with reinforcements, three thousand shy. Fifteen two sixty seven. I don't know where they're dying. Or well, the Russians are doing occasional invasion attempts. Yeah, it's creeping up, but not down. So I don't know. Making the planes whenever possible. This is probably going to planes instead of recruitment. Actually, no. I think that needs them all before I can do it. I don't know. Alright, got our CAGs. CAS, rather. Wait from 1950 to bother doing that. Takes three years just to research it. Push up as support. Actually, we'll go for the uh, infantry. We'll improve our marines' organisation a little bit more. All right, when are you guys going to be ready? Not a long time. British Parliament debates intervention in the Benelux. Well, you're a bit law, a bit law, a bit late. Having learnt from the Great War, the British will not underestimate the strategic value of me and the potential risks of seeing enemy countries build influence there. The British Parliament has debated the possibility of military intervention. While the political implications of such action weighed heavily on Winston Churchill, several decisive arguments were delivered before it was decided that the rest of the debate would be conducted in closed chambers. What are you doing? Don't try and come up here. Good. Deselect. That's a close one. Um, Landward fortifications. So I don't know which branch this he's still doing. Hmm, there it is. Trying to hold Hong Kong. A bit late. Landward fortification. Add three land fort in a province in the state of Hong Kong. Add two anti-air. An anti-air. In order to influence China. 
All right, whatever. Well, we can take a short break here. When we come back, we will possibly be ready to go on this. I hadn't seen that progress bar there before. That'll make it easier. But it's a couple hundred days to go waiting for the invasion to be ready. So we'll do it when we can do it. All right, see you again soon.